So what did you make of the uh, turnout tonight? <laughs> well, I was very, very pleased that so many people were here. Um, it's the first year it's ever been done, and when we came up the street, we thought, oh, well, there's a fairly healthy turnout, but by the time we got to it, there were literally a couple of hun- couple of not a hundred thousand, a couple of thousand. Uh, you couldn't really, all the traffic was stopped and um, it was really exciting, really, really excellent atmosphere and all the shots look amazing. So um, you can hear the carols going off in the background. So it's a very, it's a really good evening. So how did you feel to be asked to be the star guest tonight? Yes, um, I was really like just um, honoured and delighted to be asked to uh, turn on the lights for Marlow because it's the first time it's been done, as I said, and. Um, it's just really, um, yeah, you feel very, very, very proud uh, to be the one um, asked. And it's, uh, it's a very humbling experience as well because you all these people have come out. And of course, they're coming for the shops, but it's nice that they've actually turned up. And uh, do you think this is a, a fitting sort of start to Marlowe's Christmas countdown? Yes, this is a very fitting um, countdown to the Christmas time. And uh, I mean, it's looking great, and you've got all the twinkly lights on the top of a double-decker, open-top double-decker bus. Can't get better.